Yo, what is up everyone? Today I'm gonna show you how to make a, a pickle barrel boat. It's basically a boat made out of um, a barrel, like metal or plastic. I'm gonna show you the process right now. Alright, here's the barrel I'm going to use. Uh, I'm gonna show you what I've done. Basically, you see these lines? I have uh, made <laughs> made uh, lines like perfectly. So it doesn't get like uh, tilted or anything. So it's very precise, and you really need to get that. And you want to cut these lines with the angle grinder, and of course make the lines the shape uh, that you fit in, so you doesn't make it too uh, too small or too big. I'm not going to leave any measurements because that is just it. Just for me, you know, it's a personal boat. It's not supposed to be used for anyone else. So. Now we're going to cut it with the angle, angle grinder. Alright, so I'm sorry for all the background noise because my neighbors are uh, cutting the lawn, so... But I'm just going to show you the, uh, the uh, stuff you need for it. You of course need an angle grinder with some wheels. Uh, and you need these uh, safety glasses because you don't want to get splinters in your eyes. Uh, here you have uh, just a cord over to my uh, uh, broken space. And you need some gloves. Alright, as you can see right here, we have um, my dad has cut out uh, half the holes. I'm just going to show you uh, cut it here and here. Now we just need to cut right down here and here. Like it's razor sharp, you know. You don't want to cut yourself on this because it is really bad. We're going to ground it down with the angle grinder to make it a little bit more round, you know. So yeah, that's the next thing we're going to do. because we got really dressed yesterday so here I got this metal file that I'm going to uh, get uh, these sharp edges right here even though we did a little bit with the angle grinder that wasn't good enough so yeah I'm gonna do that right now Now that you have uh, done this uh, with the uh, grinding with the sandpaper and stuff, and it, uh, the edges are all nice and clean, so now we should just move on. Yeah. Uh, now that you have sanded out your uh, barrel, you're going to get your rubber melt and you're going to flat to get all the rust to fall down. Now you're gonna get 
pressure uh, uh, high pressure washer I'm gonna wash out the down you want to uh, take out the, the cork so the water can flow out I have one up the hair and one down here so let's go forward